You know where to find me. Murder this with Abby. A quarter of that dad we drink it with no ID. All the fatty gang, yo. I block entertainment. Everybody's on it. Cause we get famous. You know where to find me. Yo, what's up everybody? My name is Pav and this is Real Talk in the Hood. But before I get started, I would like to send my condolence out to everybody who lost a loved one in the hood. It's always a tragedy when a loved one is lost. The show is based upon your concerns in Mount Vernon. My first guest to attend the show is Kyle, a.k.a. Leezy. He gonna voice his opinion on what's been going on in the hood. If anybody else wanna voice their opinion, hit me up at 914-772-0123. All the footage is gonna be located on highblock.com. Also, if you wanna promote your albums, your parties, cookouts, or whatever, etc. Just hit me up. I hope you guys enjoy the show. I'm Pat. This is the first season of Real Talk in the Hood. Please, I want to thank you for being the first guest to attend the show. I'm just going to be asking you a few questions based on what's going on in Mount Vernon. You feel me? It's not an obligation, only answer what you may wish. Excuse me now if I offend you in any way. Appreciate it. My first question is. Are you originally from Mount Vernon? If so, which part of town? Definitely from Mount Vernon, Southside. Born and raised. Okay. Um, within the last three months, there have been six time sides. How you feel about that? I mean, honestly, this is what happens around this time of year. We all used to this, you know what I'm saying? I wish it wasn't like this, but when it gets nice outside, this is what happens, you know? Hopefully we can figure out how to prevent these events. You knew everybody, you were saying that you knew everybody who got killed, right? Yeah, I knew everybody. Okay. Did you attend all the wakes and funerals? Everybody's wake and funeral except for Tony. Tony Ellis, mm. personal reasons, just chose not to attend. But I wish his family all the condolences and speedy recovery. I wish y'all all the best. I feel you. How old are you, if you don't mind? 27. I okay. turned 28 in June. My question to you. Um, how do you think we can change? What do you think we can change as like the older guys for the youth coming up after us? Like, what do you think we can do to make it better? Instead of criticizing the youth, the older guys should teach them. Instead of calling them punks and we used to fight back in my day, teach them. Because you're calling them punks and all they know how to do is pick up a gun. You're only adding fuel to a flame that's already lit. Because they want to prove to y'all that they're not punks. You they mentioned to me before that um, normally someone in Mount Vernon knows someone who's involved in something. Or from that side of town, the group, and they don't step in to try to like call the truth. Like, how do you feel about that? Like, What do you think they should do to resolve the problem, basically? Bottom line, if you know two people that's beefing, and you cool both of them, sit both of them down and dead that situation. Because it's... For you to sit back and watch them beef and fight and hurt and injure each other is, is, is ridiculous. Like, how are you going to call them your friends? I feel you. Know? And you could have stepped in and you simply just resolve the whole problem and before somebody got laid down. And people is I respect dying. that. I it's not, it's not like that. We're not fighting no more. Like, they're not, that's not happening. All of them meet up one-on-one. -on -one, that been done. It's not happening. So for you to be the mutual friend and you know they got beef, step in. Step in and then resolve that before one of them end up dead. Because that's what's happening. I dig it. I definitely dig it. Briefly, um, tell me about yourself. Like, what do you do with your spare time? Like, you know what I'm saying? Who you cool with? Just give me a little bit about yourself. You could tell the viewers. You don't got to tell me. Just tell them who you are, what you do, basically. I mostly work. Monday to Friday, I'll be at work. I come down here on the weekends, check my mom's family, friends. Get a drink or two, go to the bar, watch the game. Have, it's about having fun at this point now. It's just about having fun, having a good time. Basically, you, know, you just tell me you're a laid back type of guy. You just chill, relax. You don't yeah. really look for trouble if nah. it comes to you. It, you it come, but it, do whatever you need to do to survive, basically. Yeah, and it comes my way. Anybody watching this is going to know. You know, Y'all know me, you know. I haven't been in situations, but I promise you, like, I don't invite none of this. It just happens, you know. But I, for one, have been that mutual friend and, and dead it be between people. You know what I'm saying? When I knew, you know what I'm saying? There's a lot of people still alive today because I was the one that stepped in to stop their situation from getting out of control. I feel that's what it is. That means you care. That means you're not really about the, the nonsense, the BS. But, um, yo, I want to thank you for coming to the show. You feel me? I want to get us to you. Real talk in the hood. You feel me? I was looking forward to 
seeing you in the near future. Yeah. Uh, what's up? Feel me? Real talk in the hood. Yeah, Appreciate cool. that. Um, if you know anybody who rap, play ball, anything, make clothes, take my car, get them my number, tell them just come through, come holler at me. You feel me? Definitely. The next time I come, I'm gonna bring another, I'm gonna bring another street dude around. We gonna get his side of the story. I appreciate that. You know what I saying? definitely appreciate that. Real Dope. talk. Appreciate you coming through. I'm gonna take this time now. Send my condolences to everybody who lost a loved one in the hood. It's always a tragedy when a loved one is lost. I also want to thank my sponsor, JC Thomas, MDM Million Dollar Mind, for letting me come through and do this event here. You know what I'm saying? It's real talk in the hood. Later. I said my city, my city, my city's on the map. I said my city, my city, we gotta bring it back because my city, my city, big dogs, no cats in my city, my city, Mount Vernon, where you at? My city, my city, my city's on the map. I said my city, my city, we gotta bring it back because my city, my city, big dogs, no cats in my city. My city, Mount Vernon, where you at? I said my city, my city, we gotta bring it back because my city, my city, four squares feel like a trap. Welcome to Real Talk. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'm Pat. I'm gonna be the host for today. I'm gonna um, bring it back. I'm gonna bring it back one time for y'all, y'all motherfuckers. <laughs> Yo, it's Pat. Feel me? Well, nah, I got that shit off. <laughs> <laughs> these events. Are you cool with it? Um, any of the people who've been dying lately? Yeah, all of them. All of them. I was cool with all of them. Real cool. Knew them real well. I'm <laughs> sorry, though. <laughs> Kyle, you too serious yeah, for me right now. Up. This thing Kyle Dom here. He's like, yeah, hell yeah, yeah. Yo, what's good? It's your boy at Get Money Pat. I'm live here at the. Mm, blah, blah. My first request. Try. To all the viewers, I want to thank y'all for watching the show. You can watch all of the fuck. You can catch all of the. the you can catch all of the, the fuck. So, how you feel about the previous homicides in the town? It's been a lot within the last three months. Six. Cut. Cut. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what's good, everybody? My name is Pat, for those who don't know. And this is Real Talk in the Hood. This is going to be strictly... Blah, 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 blah. This is for everybody who likes to gossip on Facebook and Twitter. You can come through the mess hall and I can... Blah, 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 blah. Mm -hmm. My first question to you is, how are you originally from my run? <laughs> 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 Yo, so where you from, man? Too much detail. I promise you know you mean? That. Yeah. Because you're supposed to keep it brief. Blunt is the best thing you can do, my nigga. Keep, keep Straight it. up. Be blunt, my nigga. Fake ass. Spike Lee, motherfucker. Fuck up, little nigga. You mean Spike, nigga? Take your sip. To all of you, I want to thank you guys all for watching the show. You can watch all of the deleted scenes at www.hoblock.com. Or you can comment on my Facebook page at Real Talk in the Hood. If anybody's interested in coming to the show, you can call me directly at 914-772-0123. Or you can email me at p.reams at yahoo.com. Real Talk in the Hood. Let's get it. Thank you all for being patient. Sorry that I kept you waiting. Now we about to take flight. Universal elevation. I was battling with Satan. Now I know the Lord got it.